this bear is gonna f some people up. When I first heard about Cocaine Bear, I just remember thinking, it's a hell of a title. A bear? Cocaine? It's a cocaine bear. It's a comedy, but scary. We have such good luck in nature. It's so out there and bizarre. And the real story is out of control. Millions of dollars worth of cocaine fell from the sky. Andrew Thornton II, this notorious drug runner. Wow. He threw bags of cocaine into the Appalachian Mountains. The drug dealer went to go find the duffel bags, but what found it first was a black bear. And the bear had consumed 70 pounds of cocaine. And what happens when all these characters come together in the Chattahoochee Forest? That bear's worth 14 million. I'm looking for my daughter. Bears are very peaceful creatures. You're safe. Bears can't climb trees. Of course they can. <gasps> Horror and comedy are like two sides of the same coin. I'd love to not remember that. But it kind of seems like the thing that stays with a man forever. I essentially make comedies and I put them inside of other movies. And this is a comedy inside of a horror movie. I, I don't like this, please stop. Ooh. I've gotten the opportunity a few times to work for actors turned directors and EB is just wonderful. She loves improvisation, and she has this unique feel of what is funny and what is true. The bear did cocaine. A bear did cocaine. This is exactly what I think would happen if a bear was on cocaine. There you go, girl. Yeah. <laughs> The bear. It loves cocaine. 